we love animals. Um, cats, dogs, whatever. We just love animals. Love watching Animal Planet. Just <laughs> any any type of animal. Um, we want to adopt eventually, but right now it's just not a good time for us to have a dog full time. So the next best thing we can do is foster dogs. We're just kind of here to tell our story and how easy it is to foster because it's so needed right now. Michigan Humane Society works with you so well to find the right dog for your schedule. They lay it out pretty easy for you. We go pick up the dog. They give us everything, crate, dog food, leashes, collars. If we need a bowl, dog food bowl, anything that we need, it's all given to you. So as the foster parent, all you have to do is provide the love and care and attention and the rehabilitation that the animal needs. And I'd say MHS has done a phenomenal job at supporting us with everything. Um, if something does pop up, um, they jump on it um, ASAP. The re really the biggest thing is um, these animals just need to be loved. And uh, that's one thing we've really enjoyed um, is that we, we are getting broken dogs and we're fixing them um, mentally. Um, and, and for this one, she had a blue cast on when we first got her. Dr. Tate will tape you up. It's like taking it's like taping your ankle before a game. And now she's just running all over the place, running upstairs, downstairs. <laughs> We've tried to get her a few jobs, one of which being at IHOP. <laughs> People <laughs> were calling her IHOP and peg leg because she was so cute with her cast. When she first got out the cast and she didn't completely trust it, she would kind of sit down on her back legs and she would stand herself on her right leg and this one would kind of just sit there and it was the cutest thing ever and along with that she's kind of grown out of it but one of her ears would stick up and the other one would be bent and it was it was like postcard yeah, pretty. It yeah it really was I, I was hoping it would stay forever but yeah, she grew out of it I yeah. guess. When you see these dogs these dogs are emotionally um, broken and, and in our experience they've had physical breaks and strains and heartworms and, and all types of things and uh, but after you know you love them from the time you get them until you they're adopted, you see them just grow. I think for us and for anyone that fosters, it's it's a process that you can really see the change in the dog and how much you've helped them. When we got her, she used to only chew on me and Golden, and now she just very sweetly plays with her own toys. There's people that really get emotionally attached to the dogs that we foster just like we do because it's like you're seeing this story of this broken dog and how it changes over time and we're always just tagging M Humane on Instagram and just you know the power of social media and everyone kind of shares it and then pretty soon that's how all of our dogs have gotten adopted. Good sit. You know, we've been a part, we've gone to the MHS and on our off day and walked the dogs, um, but still not the same. Um, just being, being loved is always gonna, gonna win in, in puppies and in life and in America.